Hello again, I'm Cody for UK Tutorials from UK2.net. For today's tutorial, I will show you how to install WordPress on your shared hosting account. WordPress is a program that helps you create and manage your website. It's extremely popular. In fact, over 20% of all websites on the internet are made and managed with WordPress. There are two ways to have a UK2 website with WordPress. I'll show you both of them in this video. Let's start by signing in to chi.uk2.net with your username and password. The first and easiest way to get WordPress is to purchase a premium WordPress hosting package. This is a hosting package that is specifically designed for WordPress. It includes several premium themes, Cloudflare access, and access to UK2 support 24-7. The other way to install WordPress is through cPanel in your shared hosting account. If you have a shared hosting package, click on the Shared Hosting tab here. Then click your domain. Now click the cPanel link at the top of the window. This is cPanel. It's the platform for managing your shared hosting account. You can find out more about cPanel in the UK2 knowledge base. To install WordPress, scroll down to the Softaculous Apps installer. Find WordPress, then click Install. Fill out the fields that come up. Protocol should be HTTP unless you have SSL on your account. If you've purchased an SSL, pick HTTPS. Choose the domain for which you want to create the WordPress site. This next step is very important. The directory specifies where on your site WordPress will be installed. It default enters as WP, but if you leave it as that, you won't be able to see your WordPress page unless you go to www.yourdomain.com WP. If you want visitors to see your WordPress site when they go directly to your domain, delete WP and keep this field blank. Pick a site name for your site. Then add a description. I'll put Homepage for UK Tutorials. Leave Enable Multi-Site turned off. Then fill in the admin account information. This will be how you sign on to WordPress. So create a username and password that's both personal and secure. Select your language. Now click the plus sign by Advanced Options and enable the following options. Check Limit Login Attempts. Change the database name. Change the prefix if you prefer. Next, click the box next to Auto Upgrade, Auto Upgrade Plugins, and Auto Upgrade Themes. WordPress accounts, if not updated, are vulnerable to hacks, so keep them updated automatically by selecting these options. Now click Install. After the installation is complete, you'll now be able to access your WordPress admin site by going to your domain slash wp dash admin. If your domain were example.com, you would go to example.com slash wp dash admin. That does it for today's UK tutorial. For more UK tutorials, head on over to our knowledge base at uk2.net or click below to subscribe. Mm -hmm.